The following program is rated low, and staff improvement is advised. Listen, how do you cook a cat? Hi, hi. No, no, I can't talk about cats because I've got some friends that are like hideous and stuff, and I want to eat them. studio with us we have Casey good evening good evening thanks for having me you're welcome darling anytime Kid, and Kitty welcomes you too Casey <laughs> <laughs> welcome welcome you're gonna walk out of here with another uh, string on your guitar if it keeps on doing that oh come on no way in the world Casey you've been performing around the place for 12 years Yes. You must have been a child when you started, were you? I was. I used to uh, <laughs> take my weekends off uh, school and go and do some gigs up on the Sunshine Coast, which is where I grew up. Oh, right. Yeah. So, and you do only country? Oh, no, I play a bit of everything, but my, my album and um, most of my original music is, is country, but around the clubs and pubs that I play at, I play a fair variety of music, yes. I mean, from rock and roll through to pop music. So, where did you start out? Um, when I was about four years old, I learnt my first song with a tape recorder. I just used to press play and backwards because I couldn't read at this point. So, no. I learnt my first song like that and performed it for my grandma. And um, from then I just had the bug and I decided I wanted to be a singer. So, I was about um, 11 or 12 when I did my first performance, which is a keyboard concert. And then... Um, I, from there, started playing guitar and I went to play at the markets in at Nambour. They used to have some markets in there. And one day I was busking in there and I met Keith Urban's father. And he said, why don't you go and sing up at the muster? Oh, <laughs> wow. That's what sort of kicked the country thing off. Yes. Yeah. And was your family all musical? You know, were you brought up in a musical house? Yeah, my dad sings and all his brothers sing as well. So they were very musical and had bands back many years ago now. Mm, <laughs> right, so that's where your influences started. Yeah. Right. Well, it's all paid dividends for you, your singing and your, all the rest of it, because... You graduated from the Australian Country uh, Music College in uh, 2001. You're a two-time Star Maker Grand Finals, which in 2002, 2003. You're three times Female Club Entertainer of the Year for South East Queensland in 03, 04 and 05. Yes, And fun. the big one, in 2007, you were named the Capital News Rising Star Female of the Southern Stars Independent Country Music Awards. Yeah, down at Mildura. Yeah, Mildura. Gee, oh, wow. So it's all paid off for you. Yeah. The next so. one, Golden Guitar. <laughs> <laughs> Certainly give it a good shot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. And the Mildura Festival, are you back again this year? I'm not. I've been to Mildura many, many times, mm -hmm. but it's a very long drive from Queensland. <laughs> <laughs> so I haven't been for the last couple of years, but it's a great festival. If you haven't been down to it, it's definitely worth going. And they have such a variety of artists and so many artists as well over a 10-day period so uh, and all the entertainment's free wow. like most festivals so yeah. that's um, and all independent artists as well so Mildura is good for the independents in that, in that way yeah absolutely I think the uh, three main festivals in Australia for the country music industry is uh, um, Tamworth obviously and then you, the Master and Mildura but they're all very different festivals and they've all got some great things going for them um, Tamworth's great as far as um, you get 
you know, your mainstream acts and as well as the independent acts and there's so many different places to go and have a look at the entertainment and then you've got the muster which is like a real party vibe. <laughs> oh yeah. And I've, I've played up there. And Six been, days of party. Yeah, something. absolutely. <laughs> and I've played up there quite a few times over the years and, and they're just great crowds up there. They always go up there and have a drink and take their mates and they've got their campsites set up. Yeah. Yeah. Does your mum know this? <laughs> <laughs> She's been there too. <laughs> Mum's taught her that. Yeah, what do you can... think we're around for, mothers? <laughs> we show them what to do. She wants to retire from being a roadie now. She <laughs> <laughs> so listen, um, Casey, you do your songwriting. Do you yes. do much songwriting? Yeah, I've done uh, quite a bit over the years. And uh, the country music college that I went to in Tamworth really focused on that. And um, it's a bit of a passion of mine, so I've continued to do it ever since. And half of the songs on my album are original songs, and um, I've been writing since then, and as well as co-writing with other people. Stacey and I have written a little bit of a tune as well. Oh, lovely. Still work in progress. Yes, oh, that's great. And uh, you're going to perform for us tonight too, aren't you? Live, acoustic here. Yeah, on, that'd be great. Right in the studio. Have you got any... Thing in particular you'd like to um, play for us? I'm or play a another new one. one? A new you one. Tell okay. Me to listen. I've been trying. You say that I'm missing the point that you're making. You got me thinking. I'm contemplating. That we should just walk away Well I've made my mistakes And you've thrown them back at me Well I know I'm no angel Oh but honey can you see I've learned my lesson Distant. We should just walk away We've talked and talked and talked it out well, It breaks my heart to say Tears will rain so hard to lie The feelings washed away You could never give There's no use complaining All that I'm saying is that we should walk away But our love has disappeared mm -hmm. Not pointing fingers No, there's no one to blame I should not have asked you What you could never give No use complaining that I'm seeing that we should walk away Congratulations. So you haven't recorded that one yet? Not yet. Okay. I just did, though. Well, beautiful. <laughs> you have. That is fabulous. And